Welcome to the episode today. Today I want to talk about thinking outside the box. That's why I have the box for visual 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 representation. So uh so I, I was thinking about this today. Today I got a lot of work done, a lot of like important work done. Work that is now out of the way and now I can focus on the vlog. So that's good. Anyways, I was like thinking about today and I'm thinking about like my job here as a YouTuber. Have you noticed, I'm gonna bring the camera down by the way, I feel like it's a little too high. Have, have you noticed I've been in that mode of like talking about YouTube, like the bigger picture and like YouTube. Um, Anyways, I was thinking about like being a you like a YouTuber, like a YouTuber. Like I, I feel like it's a weird job to have, and I, I feel like saying you're a YouTuber basically means, you know, I'm kind of self-absorbed, and I make YouTube videos, and people watch me, and I think it's great, and I get all this stuff from it. Where like I feel like. I'm a creative, I'm a creator, I create things and people who enjoy the things I create watch them and for me that is gratification for me and it's not all about me and it's not all about what I need, it's about what the audience wants and having that, that, that energy back and forth over the internet but that's not what this episode's about, this episode's about again thinking outside the box and so like one thing I've been thinking about today is how as a creator how can I be from inside the box to outside the box. I didn't know that was in there. I thought that'd be cool though. Um, to outside the box. How do I go from like thinking creatively like inside this to thinking outside this without having to change the shape of the box? I guess that's one way to think about it. How do I like bring my mind, bring my creative mind and think outside, think different than other creators? And I think recently it's starting to like mold and form and I'm not a hundred percent there yet but I'm just getting closer every single day um, well Parker and I are working on um, building this like community of our friends who are creators to help each other out I think that's a step forward into into creating outside the box into not being just conformed into well we're just gonna make YouTube videos and that's what we're gonna do having something bigger than ourselves and having something that's means more than just a YouTube video something that maybe is a full-length documentary something that's maybe just printed photos that will never be on internet ever something that is bigger than ourselves and I think I'm really into that right now like really into that I was talking to Tristan today about some stuff and it kind of sparked this whole idea for the episode and then throughout the week I've been talking to Parker he's been out on a project that's gonna be on this channel on Monday for hitting 3,000 subscribers and talking to him about like creating outside the box and doing things that are out of my comfort zone and and doing certain things and like skydiving is a big thing of that like I'm doing something outside my comfort zone to jump out of a plane at 18,000 feet That is against your natural instinct, and to get that to be your normal instinct is now being outside that box, literally and figuratively. And I feel like I'm trying to do that creatively and not stay inside the box or not be outside the box and get back into the box. I think being creative enough where you can be kind of out there but still be accepted while you're out there. And I think when I bring myself when I gather a bunch of creators in and bring a bunch of people who do things that I don't do but are really good at what they do and helping them do whatever they can do better. I think that's where I thrive right now and I think that doing this whole creator help and creator thing is just another way to introduce me to that, introduce myself to get outside my own comfort zone and I'm excited for that. I'm really pumped to 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 look back on what what I was and look back on and see what I where where I will be, you know, in, in the future. Look back on like today and think, man, I had something going there. Or maybe I'm thinking I didn't have something going there. But I think 
thinking outside the box and especially like creating outside the box is a way to force yourself out of your comfort zone and a way to learn new things. Like vlogging for me was very weird at first. It was weird for me to look into the camera and not look here because right now I'm looking at the monitor but, it, but I had to get used to looking here and connecting with you guys but when I'm talking to you it's just a camera. It's not a guy saying, yo, yeah, okay, I get that, or, or affirmation right now. It's, it, it happens later, and I, I learned that out of, you know, 321 episodes. I've learned that this is me communicating. This is how you vlog, and it felt weird at first, and I was out of my comfort zone to do this in public, and now it feels very natural, and it's kind of one of the only ways I can get out is to vlog, and now I have to learn how to put down the camera and go out without that, but it feels weird because I'm always thinking, okay, this is content. How can I feel? Okay, I, I, awesome. I got my phone. I film it off my phone, and then I realize it's not going to look good, so I need to get, I need a microphone. Okay, let me get... And I have to realize to go outside those walls and live outside those walls for a little bit and it's gonna feel uncomfortable. And I heard this quote when I was in high school. You have to learn, you have to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. And I think that's so true, especially with like new, new ventures and new things that I wanna do and trying to create outside the box. It's gonna be uncomfortable, but you have to be comfortable with that uncomfortable with that uncomfortableness. So yeah, sorry if this episode like really wasn't for you, it's probably more for me to look back on and for me to... This was a therapy type of session episode, so I'll put some text right here, um, you know, about a, so that quote, you have to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. I'll put that text right here, but I think that's a really important quote for this episode. I'm not quite sure why I made this episode. I felt like I just had to get it out there, but I feel like, I feel like in a few weeks, months, maybe even a few years or a year, this episode will make a lot of sense. So I don't know why I made this episode, but I feel like it's very important. That's why I made it. But there's probably a deeper meaning somewhere down the road. Yeah. Maybe that'd be a cool outro screen.